5499, you have successfully completed the life cycle AIDS ride and have ridden 545 miles from San Francisco to Los Angeles. Report on how the ride will eradicate AIDS from planet Earth. Ah uh, yes, it was fabulous. I'm screen. First I felt right at home because I was at command center. But then I saw other signs of alien interest in planet Earth. There were spacemen and secret codes and Lieutenant Yohuras. I thought she was darker than that. And then I was alarmed at the animals that were captured and strapped to the cranial protection devices. They had the same glazed look in their eye. Most seemed strangely happy except for one. I was worried that they might put me on a helmet. But then I read the daily spin and I realized it was just for fun. And I knew exactly who I wanted to put on my helmet. <laughs> When it was time to ride, we used code to tell the other riders how we were feeling. Thumbs up means I'm fine but I'm damaged. Thumbs down means I need help. For camp life, we regenerated in sleeping pods. I lived in sector L11. All of the sleeping pods looked the same. Seven of nine would have loved it. Here I am with my tent. Carrying my cycle body made me my own tent. I love her. I could not find my tent because it all looked the same. Here I am at dinner. Earthlings require enormous amounts of nourishment to regenerate. Chocolate milk was all the rage. We patiently waited in lines for food, the showers, and the bathrooms. Earthlings also need to rest, so at rest stops, there was the cookie lady who gave away a bazillion cookies. Paradise Pit scooped ice cream for hours. For exploratory reasons, I tried all of the flavors. Then there are rest stops where earthlings dress up in all kinds of uniforms. I think this is Cotton Candy Lady. The most fun was when I got to dance with the boys of Studio 4. Hey, the greatest day of all was Red Dress Day. Red Dress Day is to make a symbolic red ribbon across California and to outdo each other in costumes. The camp awoke to laughter as earthlings changed into their red uniforms. Everybody here was in red. Here I am checking my messages for seven of nine. And here are some of my new girlfriends. Ah oh yeah, that's me, assimilating into the culture. I saw the ocean and relaxed in the sand and played in the water. If everybody had an ocean across the USA. And I got to meet celebrities. Hello, writers! Hello, roadies! I just loved it when she said that. 5499, this is fascinating, but how will it rid the planet Earth of AIDS? I was part of 2,500 riders, and we raised $11.6 million. That's a lot of money! We saw videos every night of how the dollars were used to help Earthlings with AIDS. I recommend that after AIDS is eradicated that we keep all of those that rode and all of those that supported them. They're good humans. They care about one another and are kind. 5499, you have done an exceptional job and deserve a vacation. Yippee! Hmm. Goodness gracious, it's hot out here. Uh, yes, that brings us to your next assignment, Global Warming. There is an idiot of a world leader exasperating the problem right now, so you might as well rest until he is out of office. Cheers.